துணைத்திக்காரி சந்தேகம் என்ன சொல்லி சத்தியமாய் தீர்த்து வைப்பே There was a young woman called Issa Priya who was their news broadcaster. I met her a number of times. Issa Priya is a singer, she's an actress as well as a news reader. I've never seen anybody who's that beautiful and charming. I mean, I think this is incredibly significant, not just because it's a horrible incident, although it's certainly that, but because taken along with all the other evidence of executions and mistreatment of prisoners at the end of the war, it suggests something systematic. Uh, and in an army as disciplined as the Sri Lankan army, that suggests responsibility can go right to the very, very top. And it, it shouldn't be forgotten that, you know, we know where this happened. We know who was in charge. So if we know that, why hasn't the Sri Lankan government investigated, especially given all the, the calls on them to investigate from the UN and even from our Prime Minister. And what's the impact going to be? I think the impact is going to be uh, very, very significant. If you take the examples of what looked like a mass execution of prisoners, these all add up possibly to the claim that this was in fact systematic and, and that would, could point to the highest levels in the military authority of Sri Lanka as being responsible for war crimes of summary execution, killing and torture.